Our fair temple of sport on the most sand has bore witness to some excellent players in my time. Frederick Tomas, Quentin Bernardo, Abdel Hakim Arani, Ali Bamba, Anthony Derlard. But one imported talent was in a class all of his own. Fus Yeni Cisse. The one club Parisian has decided to call it quits after 13 years of playing under me, leaving an indefinite legacy behind. 400 plus appearances and 174 goals are all time club records, backed up by 79 assists and an average rating to die for. Promotion was my objective and financial comfort was non existent. It took a mammoth effort in the second season to go all the way. Cisse's says 23 goal season owed a lot as he won the title on the final day. How apt it was that he nearly scored the first chance in our top flight debut and then credited for setting up the landmark first goal for new signing Yaya Sonogo. Cissé cared not for reputations and this fearlessness rubbed off his teammates as we took some massive scalps. Including this smash and grab 2 all draw away to Paris Saint Germain. This allowed us to comfortably survive relegation. Buoyed by the feel good atmosphere, Le Mans ambitions grew loftier as we stabilised our position. You are guaranteed entertainment on the MM Arena grounds and our league positions continue to justify it. However, tried as we might, qualification for continental football was denied again. And again. And again. Cissé deputised when the going got tough. And on one fateful night in the Val, our rivals in the Pays de la Loire region. He once more played hero and ensured a playoff spot for the Champions League. By getting the better of Real Sociedad, we were granted access to perform on the greatest stage. And, like all great showmen, Cissé was ready to take his spot on the tallest pedestal. They'll uh, realise what we're up to. But Eddie Carlos does very well. Eddie Carlos, Cissé again. He's dribbled the keeper. 1-0. <laughs> Well, here's Harrison to Ali Bamba. He's got two in the box, three maybe. Say, say, Charlie, yes! We three need to one. get this point. Masakni, help him out, my friends. Come on. Masakni, say, say! Two, two! Get it there! Brilliant, brilliant play. The counter attack pays off. We were too naive in that first pilgrimage, but ready for more. Cissé made his first start of the second attempt count with this vital goal against Fenerbahce. The draw set up a must-not-lose game between Le Mans and Juventus. Cissé carelessly lost possession in the 83rd minute, allowing the Italians to draw first blood. Rather than wilt away, Fusieni, fueled by passion, was destined to redeem his error in emphatic Bamba fashion. He goes for a goal, but the keeper was easily going to get there. Zhang, through to Orban. Cissé, he's done it! 1-1, one, one. and we're back in the game! Oh, I don't believe that! Come on, don't give it up now, please! Come on! Come on, please! Get that ball, get that ball! Come on, Bamba, Martin, Gerard! He finds Orban, Orban to cross, come on! Oh! Come on, Pelopin! Yes! Yes! It's in from CC! CC turned the game around! In the final group game, we had to get payback on Celtic and Scotland to progress. Cue another CC brace to complete the mission. Our reward? Barcelona in the last 16. Thanks for the hope hits this on his head. CC! I don't believe it! We needed an away goal at the new camp. And had this through ball been played for Cissé instead of by him, history might have been kinder. Alas, we were eliminated. Later in the same year, we finally won the club's first ever cup competition, the Coup de la Ligue. Aggravatingly, 
we were helpless with the league begging to be won just a month later, undoubtedly our greatest ever regret. Cissé's powers were beginning to fade at this stage, but he still hit the net against the two clubs that celebrated domestic and European glory instead of him in his retirement year, Marseille and Manchester United. Fusieni's contributions have left the club in a greater position. We're now a solid top three club, able to attract global talent and nurture academy starlets. Thank God they didn't pick up his offside habits. Although it may feel gloomy right now, the sun will rise again. Goodbye for now, Fusieni. We love you. Who else but Fusieni?